Hi, this is Dan from Pool and Spa, and today we're going to do a short how-to video for you about how to seal leaks in tile pools. Most of the time, luckily, the leaks occur right around the water level. That's the most common place where you will have either a tile crack or the grout come out. You got to turn the pool off, make sure you pull the pins out of the timer, and plug with little rubber plugs, your return plugs and the skimmer plugs. You want to let the pool sit for 24 to 48 hours. So basically you want to isolate everything so that you're not talking about a leak in the return lines or the skimmer or the pool system, that it's just the tile. Again, in probably eight out of 10 situations, the water is going to stop at one of the grout lines and this is what you're hoping for. If that's what happens, you want to buy a clear, waterproof silicone sealer. You don't want to buy silicone glue and don't try to go in and buy the color matched ones because the odds of you color matching your tile and grout with silicone is pretty much nil to none. So once it's applied, you can just take your finger, wipe it across the area where you have the leak and then it will dry pretty much clear and you're not going to see it from a couple of feet away. While you have the water lowered at that level, I want you to go around the pool, yeah, it's going to be hard, on your knees all the way around the pool and really look very closely every place where there's grout, every tile that's at that level. If you have one tile that's split a little bit and it needs some silicone at a certain level, there's probably more than one. Wait 24 to 48 hours and fill the pool up. Fill the pool up at least an inch or two above where you did those silicone repairs and then wait. If the water continues to go down, it means that either A, you've missed a spot, which I would check, or B, it's much more of a detailed repair that might be by the skimmer or return jet or the light or something like that. If that's the case, you've tried, but you didn't do it, you gotta call a real pool guy. And when you call a real pool guy to do any sort of work on a tile pool, make sure when you call him, he knows about doing tile repairs in swimming pools because that's a very specialized area of the pool and spa industry. So that was how to seal leaks in tile pools. My name is Dan Harrison from Pool and Spa and happy swimming.